Good morning, everybody. Good morning. It is just after 8 a.m. on a Saturday morning. What's a date? I never know the date. The 9th. The 9th. November 9th, 2019. Yes. And today we're going garage sailing and we're going to bring you guys along for the ride. And hopefully we find a lot of amazing things. And for those of you new to our channel, we are going garage sailing today looking for stuff for ourselves, for presents, and then also uh, what we do full time is we buy stuff and sell it online. So if we find stuff at garage sales that we can sell for more money on like eBay or Amazon, then we'll pick it up and flip it. Yep. All right. You ready to go, babe? Yeah, let's go. Boom. Boom. Bye, Zero. Take care of the house. See you later. Bye, my pretty little French bow dog. Bye. Hey, be a good girl while we're gone, okay? So for our first sales today, we're heading right down the street to a community garage sale. Uh, that's a tip for you guys. We always look out for community sales where a bunch of people are having garage sales so we can hit them one after the other. And for us in our area, this time of the year is when everybody seems to have their community sales. So there's one literally four minutes down the road from us and we're gonna go there and hit that one first. First couple sales of the day. There's one over there and one over there. It's crazy, it's actually cool enough for Allie to wear a jacket. <laughs> Where did you get that one? Thrifting. It's a bit big though, I might sell it. Really? Oh, yeah. it's so cool. Some little sanooks. And then inside the box it has um, like two of the flanges and the tubing that comes with it too. It was like barely used. Oh, they're all sticking around there, but yeah. Ten bucks is fun. You want it? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. You have change for twenty. Yeah. Cool. I do. Thank you. I'm pretty sure it's good. I think I recognize you guys from like YouTube. Really? No way. That's awesome. <laughs> I used to do a lot of like reselling because my husband's in the military. Oh, so cool. Yeah, yeah. Like pretty good money. Nice. And then after I had the kids, it just kind of went downhill. Thanks so much. That. But you it's funny because we moved here last year, and then I would see you like on your nah. Instagram videos, yeah. like, where you guys That's would so drive funny. at, yeah. and I'm like, oh my gosh, I think we're like neighbors with this guy. We <laughs> definitely we live like friend. right down the street. <laughs> I have a friend that lived on this street. Yeah. Because yeah. like, right I would always, yeah. I think the other day, weren't you at like Big Ben? Like yeah, yes. Like, yes. Like, I'm like I recognize that That's place. so funny. It's so funny. Yeah. That's cool. No. no, it's okay. okay. Yeah, true. You're awesome. Thank you. Hope it goes well. Nice yeah. to meet you. Alrighty, first buy of the day is a breast pump. Um, funny enough, we've actually sold, how many of those have we sold? At least seven. At least, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, some of them are worth a decent amount of money. That yeah. one in particular is probably worth like between 50 to $70. And we paid 10. Mm -hmm. But we thought we would share that one with you because People ask us all the time, like, if you get recognized at a garage sale, do people, like, hike the prices up on you because they know that you're a reseller or whatever? Yeah. And I, I think we kind of find almost the reverse to be true. Yeah. Yeah. People know. Like, we will tell people if, if, if they see us looking something up or if they're, like, asking questions about us selling stuff online at a garage sale, we'll be very open with them and just tell them what we do. Yeah. And, you know, most people are having a garage sale because they want to get rid of that stuff. They don't, even if they find out that it's worth a bit more than what they're trying to sell it for at a garage sale, they're just clearing stuff out. So I guess I'm just trying to say, like, it's important just to be friendly with people. I yeah, guess. be nice. <laughs> be nice to people. Yeah. It, it goes a long way. Anyway, so it was nice to meet those people. And we paid $10, I think, for that. Yeah, 10 bucks for that uh, breast pump. And like I said, probably 50 bucks or so. Yeah, and it'll be around 15 to ship because it's pretty heavy. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Morning, how are you? Yeah. Oh. Some ears. Some R2D2 ears. Good morning. Good morning, how are you? Good morning. Those are cool. Yeah, you should get this. <laughs> Good. Ah. I'm bored. You can tell I'm bored. Some Jordans.
Fight clubs. Ding, 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 ding. cookbooks they're actually good ones too because they're spiral but they're uh, so you can open it all the way uh, Disney hat Disney hat this should go for about 15 to 20 dollars um, but Christmas is coming and it's brand new with the tag so first class we paid two dollars for it yeah two dollars for it but we might give it to a friend oh so. true yeah. Because we have lots of friends that love Star Wars. We're also just at this point just trying to buy something. Oh, okay. <laughs> There's not like the garage sales haven't been amazing today. So it's cute though. I like it. I think it's, it's very cool. Cute. What lights up? Nothing lights up. Oh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, how are you? Anytime you like, just make an offer. Alrighty. I just stuck numbers on them. <laughs> Sounds good. Oh, those are nice decanters. Ooh, a Waterford one. A Waterford decanter is pretty cool. The bigger hat's a Stetson. A real Stetson. This one is? That one's a different brand there. Gotcha. That's a real Stetson. That was about 300 bucks. Oh, wow, that's cool. Looks like an older one. Yeah, it's an older one. You got some unicorn leggings? Unicorn. Sweet. Real unicorn. Did you see this necklace? It's pretty cool. Yeah, there's a lot of cool stuff here. You guys have cool stuff. Oh, I don't need a bag. Would you take 10 on the hat? Sure. Yeah? Which one? The, te the, uh... the Stetson. Yeah, I'll take it. Yeah? Yeah. Sweet. Thank you. Or is it this way? <laughs> it's too big for me. <laughs> We've uh, we've sold Stetson hats like this for like 50, 60 bucks, so I figured it was worth a shot for 10. And it's an older one. Yeah, but which side's the front and which side's I don't, the back? I don't, I'm not a cowboy. <laughs> I think it's this way. Oh, no, it can't be that way, right? <laughs> Maybe it's an either way hat. I don't, I don't know. Get out of here. <laughs> nice. It's like this 80 year old grandma with like a Aventador. Nah. And she like has to come out like That's it's all so like cool. handicapped and she comes in and she just lays on the exhaust. And it's, it's, no it's way. Like, Where is that? Bullfrog's Lithium Pinecrest. Oh, the brewery. Oh. Yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah, yeah. It starts at uh, 11. Nice. Yeah, That's so awesome. By, there would be a brunch truck there too. So. Sweet. I think my dad mentioned That's that. a really cool cocktail shaker, by the way. That is very cool. Yeah, it's a flat black matte. Big, big fan of the matte black. You should get that. <laughs> I should get that, but I have one. Oh, okay. I don't really. It's cool, like, though. I do really like it, but I do have one, so I should I have too many. So I'm going to get yeah. this serious for two bucks. Look yeah, at these stamps, babe. Look how vintage, vintage these stamps are. Nice cool oh, wow. That's actually really cool. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. Wow. 1991. That's Those are funny. cool. So I picked up this, what is it, Sirius Satellite Radio for $2. I didn't look it up or anything. Um, I figured it's probably worth, I don't know, at least 20 bucks. Okay. But I'm going to scan it right now and see. Okay. <laughs> Here we go. Filter. Sold. Condition. Used. Ooh, do, 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 do. 25-ish. Oh. I'm going to type in the model number now t instead of scanning it and see. Oh, you can get it. You can get it brand new for 20 bucks plus shipping. Ow. So $30. Oh, well. I mean, sometimes you take a gamble, $2 gamble. Uh, one thing that I will check, though, is to see if it has a lifetime subscription. Because if it powers on and it has lifetime subscription, then it's worth like 100 plus. So that could be something, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, wait, is it new? Wait a second. Oh, it's new. Ooh. Okay. Here we go. Ooh. There we go. Two dollars into Ooh. thirty. Ooh. Ooh. Now we're making the big bucks. <laughs> do, 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 now what do y'all need do, patio do, furniture? Do. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think so. Some bats. Yeah, 
Discovery toys. Discovery toys, Super Marvel. Oh, I do remember those. My mom like only bought us Discovery toys, and they were very expensive. Really? This character is forever. I don't have my phone. Are you gonna get get it? Do you need like a whole bunch of Voss water? Oh, these are like. Oh, they're just the box. Yeah. <laughs> How much are the baseball bats or so uh, softball bats? Like two bucks. Okay. I know the one that. I was telling somebody that Easton, I remember I was the coach up here, but we may have the Easton cost oh. like 289 bucks. Yeah, the this is a, yeah, yeah, I was going to. That gonna, was the new thing when they came out. Yeah, I'm going to take that one for sure. Those are pretty sweet I'll frames. How much them. They're a really good price. Are there, I love them. Is that like actual painting in there though? Oh, you can redo it. I know. Yeah, yeah. How much do you want for these frames? Uh, like 10 bucks a piece. Oh, okay. No, thank Ten you. bucks for the pair. Ten bucks is a good deal. Sorry. <laughs> and then you said two for the bat, and then how much for the toy? A dollar. Okay. So thirteen bucks for everything. All right. Yeah, sold. Yeah, let's do that. Cool. All right. I picked up the baseball bat, Easton, uh, model SL13 X28. As you can see, it's in kind of rough shape. A little bit of chips on the paint um, but for two dollars i think we can get like 30 to 40 for that ali got some cool frames for the new warehouse yeah yeah <laughs> and then you got some childhood memories super marble works discovery it toys worth? it's probably like 30 to 40 dollars i guess on this what do we pay for it a dollar yeah, we paid a dollar for it. I don't know though. We could get really amazing pictures, and maybe we can list it at the top end. Yeah, like forty-five. Forty-five. Yeah. Let's be honest. You just want to play with it. I do. I do. I'm going to play with them as soon as we get home. Estate sales in Florida. <laughs> this is this is about accurate for a Florida estate sale. Actually, this is low. <laughs> this is intense. Whoa. Um, I don't even know where to start here. I found this Garth Brooks 1993 t-shirt, the American Honky Tonk oh, yeah. Bar Association, but it's in really bad condition. I did find this cool John Deere uh, sweatshirt though. What is that? Guys, these flip clocks are amazing. Oh, it's General a flip Electric, clock? But it's broken down here. Oh, man. I'm so upset. Oh. That'd be like a $50 item? 50 bucks. Man. It wasn't. Dang, the wrecked Chaps Ralph Lauren shorts. Oh, sad. I would have bought these for myself. <laughs> intense, yeah. Nice, babe. Which one is that? Germany? Oh, Manila. Very cool. Did you see all these? Oktoberfest 1982. Oh, that's cool. Right? Oh. That's cool bottom. What is that one? Toberfest 1985. That's cool. Dive knife. Oh, sunfish dive knife. Hmm. I think this high chair is the coolest. Oh, thing. oh. It's so it's so old. old. Yeah. Like, look at the. Um, oh wow. Yeah, it's like a wicker. It. The rattan. Was there? There was another rattan. one that we sold. That yeah. one. That yeah. one's more wicker. The other one that we sold was more of a solid kind of dark wood one. This is one of the most intense sales ever. <laughs> There's just so much stuff everywhere. These are two bucks each. They're bigger size, right? Um, I think they're largest. Here, grab that top one, the first one. So there's that one. This one's a decent pattern. It's an XL, okay. And then, is it XXL? XXL? 
I know they're not all the same size. Uh, this one's like that. Cigar. Cigars. It's kind of cool. That is pretty cool, actually. The old razor. Yeah. I wanted this phone for such a long time. <laughs> Remember when they came out? They were like a couple hundred dollars or something. Yeah. I'm pretty sure my parents bought me one like this because it was cheaper. And I was like, <laughs> oh. Yeah, agreed. Let's see. Two, four, six, eight. Twenty-eight for everything. Twenty-eight. Eight. Should I get it? How much? Wait, wait, wait. I'm from Goodwill. It's about that. <laughs> and how much did you have on this knife? Ten. Ten bucks. Okay. Okay, four. All right, cool. I was thinking. Four I'm gonna leave two. the knife. You leave the knife. Ten. Okay. Yeah. Yep. To fourteen. Fourteen. Okay. All right. Amazing. All righty. Tell us about what you found, love. I found this Starbucks mug and I looked up comps and they were actually really high. I was shocked. What so, are comps? So like $60 maybe? Wow. Yeah. Wow. Worth our time because it's going to cost at least $8 to ship. We could put it in a pad of flat rate. People do that and they wrap like cardboard around the mm -hmm. handle and bubble wrap it. So we'll see. Pretty much anytime you find a Starbucks mug that is a city, you always want to look it up to see how much they're worth. I've seen some of these things sell for hundreds of dollars. Yeah. Just make sure that they're not chipped, damaged, cracked somewhere because that will devalue them greatly. Right. So always check to make sure that they're not damaged. And this one was a dollar? It was a dollar from Goodwill. <laughs> so much stuff had Goodwill tags yeah. in there. Like this, this item. Can you guess what that is? Mama Africa. Africa. Isn't that cool? How to get it because Ryan's from Africa. Do you know what that Ooh, is there's though? There's a bug on it. Oh, it's dead, gosh. but like it's a bug. Gross. Ew. Yeah, that sale was a bit much. The clothes are in the front of the car because we don't even want to put the clothes in the car and they're going to go like straight into the washing machine. But we bought like, um, what did we buy? Three, three Tommy Bahama shirts for a couple bucks each. $2 each. $2 yeah. each. And then the vintage John Deere pullover, which was pretty cool. Um, what else did we buy? This, the mug, the frame. You got the frame. Mm -hmm. I was going to get the knife, but I left it. Yeah. Yeah. Do you know what's on that Africa? Big Five. Yeah. And it's called the Big Five. It's called the Big Five. Yeah. Good job, babe. I know things. Nicely done. You said it like I wouldn't know. Well, that's not something that everybody knows. I'm married to you. That's true. That's a good point. You also kind of looked at me like I would be stupid if I didn't know. Like, do you, you even would know? Be. Oh, wow. Wow. Out. Burn. <laughs> Burn. It's getting toasty up in here. Oh, my gosh. Uh, but I think that this is going to be the last sale we go to. It's 11.44 a.m. I'm hungry. So. Yeah. Ryan didn't feed me. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> when you get a wife, you have to feed it. That's true. You have to feed it. <laughs> or we just wither away to nothing and get very cranky. So. <laughs> true. But I think that's it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. We appreciate it. Um, sorry it wasn't like a crazy day, but we have to show you guys the reality sometimes as well. And that's part of what... That's kind of like what I'm trying to do now on the channel as well is not be too like flashy and, and here's, you know, like too, I don't know how to like say only it. show you our successes. We yeah. also want to show you our yeah. mediocre times. Um, I wouldn't call today a failure, but it was just very mediocre at mm. best, you know, and a lot of times weekends are like that. They're just mediocre. And you can't think that every time we go out, we're so successful and we make a thousand dollars because that's not Sorry. the case. And we want to show you the true reality of reselling and garage sales and thrifting. And so we hope that you're gleaming a bit of the actuality of it and not like the only exciting, most glamorous times that we have. Man, you said that way better than I did. <laughs> Nailed it. <laughs> So thanks for watching, guys. We appreciate it. Uh, leave a comment, hit the thumbs up button, and subscribe to our channel if you're not subscribed. Thumbs up. We will see you on the next video. Bye. Peace out. Bye.